Hi everyone, welcome back to Aphrodite Mennonil Tarot. Thanks very much for joining our channel today, it's very much appreciated. I just want to apologise, it's taken me a long time to upload um, videos, there's something wrong with my internet. Um, so be patient with me for those that are waiting on their, um, their personal readings that will come through soon. Okay. All right, I'm going to be using the Messages of Love Oracle deck and, and then I'll probably choose another deck. But anyway, all right, Scorpio, please only take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't make the story fit if it's not your story. Sometimes I do say he or she, sometimes the story might be vice versa. got somebody here who feels like they made a mistake okay wishes they that they could right their wrong okay i feel like this person is in a commitment and maybe they feel like they've chose the wrong the wrong person to commit to and that they want to be a part of uh, your future um so somebody wants to mend a connection between you and and them okay um all right yeah, they, they neglected you. They neglected you. This person says, I failed to give you what you needed. Um, and now they're reflecting back, okay? Being away from you has allowed me to gain, gain some clarity. I feel like this person, when they chose their partner, and there might have been a choice between you and someone else, uh, they chose that person because of financial difficulties or maybe this person was financially stable um, and they thought that this person had family values. Um, but looking at the big picture, turns out that they were wrong. Okay. And they thought that they may have had more than you and you had a lack, so that's why they chose somebody else. Okay, please only take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't make the story fit if it's not your story. Sometimes I do say he or she, sometimes the story might be vice versa. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this person is going through a lot of pain and feeling very guilty about, you know, the choices that they made and they may have caused you a lot of pain. They may have caused you a lot of damage. Um, you can't stop thinking about this person. They daydream about you. They're longing for you. Um, they always want to, like, just feel like running towards you, but they can't because they're stuck in this commitment by the looks of it. All right, well, let's get you more cards out of this deck. Yeah, they feel like you're a better person than them. They, they're feeling very unworthy right now. For especially for neglecting you and um, not making you the, the choice. All right, one more card. Yeah, this person feels very connected to you. To you. They feel like they have a soul tie with you. Um, you know, the thing is that you know, we all have choices in life and um, nothing is ever fixed in this world, to be honest. It's us that keeps ourselves um, stuck where we are. Um, but this person is definitely, you know, like feeling um, the regret of not choosing you, feeling the guilt, not seeing your value, you know. Um, they do want to mend this connection, they do. Um, but... There seems to be a but. Okay. All right. Let's see what the um, cosmic cards say. If this is you, you need to let go and make room for the new beginning uh, on its way. There's a new beginning on it on its way. Okay. If this person feels that they're connected to you, then they need to let go of what they're hanging on to. Okay. It's not going to serve them any purpose because the universe, when it, when it wants things to move forward, it will happen whether you like it or not. Okay. Alright. Two more cards.
Yeah, they're in a commitment. And this person wants to make a commitment to you though, because things are getting a little bit serious for them. Give it time, everything is in divine timing, okay? This person may have gone towards another person because of pregnancy or somebody is expecting, but they'll be back. They'll be back, expect to hear from them soon, okay? Someone is going through a divorce. They are planning to let go and they are planning to commit to you, but please only take it if it resonates to you. Um, you know, don't make this story fit. It's not for everybody. I'm going to take this card because it just, for some reason, fell into a different deck. An unexpected opportunity awaits you in your personal and professional life. The right decision, great happiness, um, bright future and success in work. Okay, so there is a lot of changes that is coming in. Um, especially the month of February from a lot of readers are saying, I don't know if that's true, but the month of February seems to be a big decision time. Okay, so um, be prepared for for next month with all of the, the changes that are going to occur according to the moon and the stars and uh, everything else. I'm not an astrologer, but I hear people um, say, but yeah, there is work coming your way. And there's somebody who wants to put a lot of hard work and effort to achieve something with you. Um, so I do feel this person is thinking, um, you know, everything in divine timing um, will flow. But, you know, uh, divine timing is when, when you feel you are ready. Not when you sit around and won't say, you know, God, universe, yeah, I'll wait for you to make the decision. No. You know, what do they say? What's that saying? Um... You know, I'm just going to say it in a way that I can interpret it is that, you know, you keep moving forward and the universe will help you to move two steps forward. So put your hand in my hand is what I'm saying. And I feel like something that those words have been said before. Put your hand in my hand. It'll make some, uh, some sense to somebody. OK, so you're coming in single, but you're coming in, um, you know, like somebody who is uh, stable, who has uh, financially secure or has enough for, for themselves, okay? A wish fulfillment that is coming your way, okay? Someone's coming out of a mental conflict. Somebody's making a decision to either unblock you or somebody who is blocked because they want to talk. They want to talk. They want to tell you they're walking away from whatever tied them up. I feel like this person is working hard to to gain a lot of finances so they can walk away. Someone seems to need more more time to think. They need space to think. I feel like if this person doesn't walk away soon, um, if you're the male, the female wants to fall pregnant, you know, there's going to be some truth and clarity that's going to be revealed here. Um, yeah, someone is moving forward with truth and clarity, once, uh, you know, that saying, once you see it, you can't unsee it. So I think like this person is now going to see it. Um, you know, they're coming out of this mental conflict. Somebody just wants to run. Someone's going to release a heavy burden. There is a conversation coming. Something is ending. Something is ending. Sorry. Something is ending and something new is going to begin. Somebody might be traveling. Uh, they want to talk to you about maybe, you know, meeting up or traveling or, come, you know, let's, let's go. I feel like there's a coffee. Can we meet up? Can we have a talk? Let's have a coffee and talk. Okay. So let's pull out a few more cards. Whoever this person is, male or female, they're stuck in a situation chose somebody over over you because they were probably more financial stable 
they felt that you had a lack or they had a lack and that's why they went towards this person okay but i feel like their heart belongs to you and they are planning on coming back okay yeah. be patient okay because if this person is coming out of the, uh, a, a marriage um, don't start a relationship yet because you'll just end up in a third party with this person. Um, you'll need to wait by your time, be patient, give them space because somebody, you know, needs to make sure. I feel like this person does want to give you equal give and take. They know that they can have everything with you. Mentally tired and trapped, they are very, you know, they kept themselves in this mental self-imposed prison. Nobody else did it but them. And they only have themselves to blame, okay? I feel like you felt that this is all a toxic situation and you're not going to wait. I feel like you want to move forward, okay? Um, this person is from your past. They do want to give you equal give and take. You've got memories with this person. They're coming out of feeling stuck, especially financially. Um, but, you know, they're mentally tied and trapped and, and hurt. And, um, you know, they are going to come out of this. They are going to come out of this, okay? They don't want to hurt you anymore. This person is making a head over heart decision regarding you, Scorpio. There you are. Because you are the soulmate. You are the true connection, okay? But in order for this to come together, they got to create a change, Okay. They're going to go through a battle. They know that they're going to go through a battle that's going to take time. But they want to talk to you about having this stable new beginning, having a family with you. They see you as the empress, somebody who is wise, or somebody who, um, you know, has a lot of knowledge and um, that they could have had a nice future with. They are spying on you, Scorpio. They're watching you. Okay, we could have a fire sign here. But they're making a decision. But there's the court case they're going to decide that they're not going to stay in this marriage any anymore there you go very clear very clear they're, they're meeting up with possibly a solicitor or a counselor or somebody that um you know and and the thing is that this person knows that um they're going to get a lot of backlash that the separation or divorce can interfere with their work they know that they're going to go through a hard time but they're doing it they're going to do it for you scorpio and you know um they're going to go through a divorce if this is you scorpio well um you know your indecision is getting you in trouble you are stuck between two um, this person is stuck between two okay you're tormenting yourself uh, with the thought of loving the wrong person. A trusted friend will offer a solution. Peace person who brings order. Woman's success depends on effort and hard work, okay? So this person has to put in the hard work and effort if they want to be with you, Scorpio. But, you know, this indecision here about whether to leave, whether to stay, whether to come, whether to go, you know, um, the in and out energy here is causing the conflict, okay? But it's very clear that this has to happen. Well, it doesn't have to, but you all have choices. But look at, look at that. Letting go, okay, divorce and commitment. So this person needs to let go, needs to get divorced and then, you know, commit to you. That's what the cards are saying, Scorpio. I'm not making this up, okay? But I feel like this person very much loved you when they chose the other person okay i don't know if it was an arranged marriage i don't know whether you had no choice because of religious reasons okay i i don't know whether um you know it was just greed that that did all this and now the karma is playing out for a lot of you scorpios you're done definitely done you don't want anything to do with this you've gone through grief you've gone through sorrow you went through a lot of pain you went through a lot of suffering because scorpios when they love they love deeply so this is for some scorpios very much off the table okay um but for some of you whoever this relates to they're coming they are coming okay um 
Let me pull out a couple of these love oracle from the love oracle deck and see if there's any more messages. Unexpected outcome. Things didn't go the way I planned. Oh, okay. Well, they certainly didn't if they're going to go through a divorce. Holding back, I should have expressed myself better. Yeah, they wish that they had told you things, Scorpio. Um, you know, I feel like when you did have this, you know, conversations with this person, it was like being on a merry-go-round. Conversation was up, conversation was down. Some things just went boom, over your head. Um, didn't understand what this person was trying to tell you, um, but. Yeah, there is going to be an unexpected outcome, okay? There is a bit of gossip going around about this person. That somebody hasn't given up hope. They haven't given up hope on us, okay? We are both hurting from this. I feel like you are both hurting from this, but um, I didn't act when I should have. So somebody thinks that this is a missed opportunity. Um, yeah, somebody wants to give you equal give and take when they're after they deal with their shadow side. But Scorpio, for a lot of you, they they are coming back. They are coming back, and you know, for some of you, this is this is definitely your twin flame. This is definitely your soulmate. You know, um, I feel like whoever stepped in between you um, knew exactly what they were doing, and they um, they played their cards well. While you are very secure in the love of this person, Scorpio, because maybe you gained their trust, maybe um, they showed you loyalty, you know. So I know with Scorpio, if you if you got trust and you got loyalty, you can become a little bit complacent and, you know, with the knowledge that your partner will never play up on you, but you you got to not underestimate the other person that is coming in to... Um, you know, to take what belongs to you. But you know, what is yours will never pass you, Scorpio. And I feel like if this person was your person, they are definitely coming back and they have, they have hope and they're hoping that you haven't given up on this situation, but they were hurting as much as you. And I feel like they were pretty damaged when you met them. So there was a lot of confusion, okay? Um, but I see a lot of happiness coming your way, Scorpio. A lot of happiness, okay? But, yeah. The message is very clear, okay? All right, Scorpio, I wish you all the best. And I, again, I apologise for the delay because the internet, it's, it took me 24 hours just to upload one video. So just bear with me while the problem gets sorted and we'll see you next time and thanks for watching and don't forget to press the like button Scorpio thank you